As they start focusing on the 2020 elections, many Democrats are embracing a very familiar song and dance. They plan on growing the size and scope of the federal government by giving out free handouts in the form of things like student loan forgiveness, free higher education, and in some cases, a living wage for those unwilling to work. Democrats expect for the American people to take these handouts and ask the important questions, such as, is this sustainable later? That failed formula is how Democrats want to tackle the funding problems of Social Security. Democrats proposed solution to enlarge the size of the program, to force the wealthy to pay more into the system, and to dramatically increase taxes in order to save Social Security. However, the problem would be better tackled by increasing the full retirement age, which has only gone up by two years over the program's 83-year history. By further streamlining the program, we would ensure that future generations are able to enjoy full retirement. Here's the bottom line. Democrats' first instinct to keep increasing the size of government is reckless and ignores the real-world costs of federal overreach. We should be looking for long-term solutions to our nation's problems, not for quick fixes. Boris, your solution ignores a growing population of people in our country. Coming up, why raising the retirement age is not an adequate fix for the Social Security program's problems. The views expressed by commentators do not necessarily reflect